remember the first day I opened my own salon, one of my regular clients, a multi-millionaire, Manny Lozano, said, Patricia, I don't care when you can't squeeze another stylist in the salon. I don't care when you can't squeeze another appointment on your calendar. You still have to keep promoting because you have to resell your staff. This is still the place they want to work and you have to resell your clients, this is still the place they want to come. I used to survey my clients, and I would often ask a new client who'd been in three or four times, may I ask why you came here? Now we always want to know where our new business comes from, but then after I, I got to them, I say, well, I know Many of our clients moved to the areas or they were referred, but surely you were going to a hairstylist before. And this is what I heard more often than you would believe, and it is true in every single business. When I first went to them, they gave me great service. And it wasn't that I didn't still have good haircuts, but they considered me their client, and they stopped trying as hard. So may I suggest, we have to keep reselling our regular clients, offering them new suggestions, showing our creativity before somebody else does. Now that's common sense, but being busy, and especially if in the past they have given you a very limited budget to work with, we sometimes think they won't go for it. Well, that doesn't mean you shouldn't keep suggesting.